Hey guys, it's me again, George here. So, one day you get home and your watt meter is showing 0.1 watts, and you're like, what's going on? Well, there can be many things going wrong in your setup, but for this example, we're gonna use that a complete cell is blocked on your solar panel. The Kyocera solar panel I'm using has 36 cells, and only one of them is being blocked from the sun and you may ask yourself why is it showing less than a watt if it's only one panel that's blocked as you can see I got one complete cell covered up with cardboard and that cardboard could be anything it could be a dead bird on your panel it could be uh, your neighbor's kid threw a frisbee on your on your solar panels I mean it can be a lot of stuff and like I said, for this example, I'm using cardboard on one complete cell, as you can see. If I go ahead and remove it and come back to my watt meter, you're gonna see 37 watts. So I went ahead and cut me a piece of cardboard, maybe two inches by three and a half. Let's see what effect this does on a cell. As you can see, I'm at 19 watts. That piece of cardboard covered up half the cell. As you can see there, one cell starts right here and goes all the way right here. So it looks like you got one, two, three, four pieces of uh, cells on there or solar panel, but it's actually one complete cell right here, one right here, and so forth. So, so as you can see, I lost 50% of my output. 50%. This little piece here is about, you know, let's say 30% of the cell that is covering up. So I'm thinking I'm going to see about 17 watts, let's say. I actually think um, <laughs> I went the wrong way. Anyways, I'm seeing about 27 watts because we got. A little bit more than half of the panel you know in sunlight so I went the wrong way anyways you might get the point there so keep your solar panels clean you know make it a habit every day you know look on your roof or if you have a way to monitor you know pay close attention and harvest all you can thank you guys